finally. Finally. Got a uh, lime mango. The last pickup I got about uh, 60, uh, 50 pounds of lime mango. The big, um, that's around one pound per each. That's, um, yeah, one package of my lime mango. And, uh, have a package here is a lemon mango and that's packets of lemon mango the balance of fried mango I picked up about five pounds and uh, this is a carry mango and this is a ice cream mango and uh, the bottom here is um, Tamiya Kiss mango okay uh, the finally the lemon mango I got this year is uh, about 250 pounds. Um, uh, that's uh, include the 52 pounds I pick uh, when it's, uh, it's still ring because um, I have to cut out the branch the branches because it's uh, on the it's, uh, it's a skew onto the neighbor side and the the tree kind of skew. Um, I afraid is this, uh, the trees is approved because it's too heavy, so that's why I cut the um, dog branches. It's uh, about fifty-two pounds, and um, um, and include this um, not um, not not include all of the green young mango a drop on the floor. I did include all the, some of them. I waited some I didn't. So that's it's about um that's exactly the amount I weighed two hundred and fifty pounds, and uh, for those it's a drop I didn't pick uh, I didn't wait I didn't count so that's uh, I lost the two hundred and fifty pounds uh, lens mango for this year's um each one around one pound per each yeah as finally uh, some is this one one pound twenty five uh. Or one couple of them is one power, uh, one and a half pounds, and um, the smallest is um, kind of a little less than a, a pound. Um, that's uh, for lens mango this year, and uh, I uh, cut some of them too. I uh, um, this year I didn't pick early most of uh, them most of. Uh, Except those I have cut the branches, uh, the rest of them I have to leave on the tree until it's ripe. Um, but the finally, because we are uh, oh, I forgot that I didn't include those um, obscuro and um, some kind of animal eat it. It's a, it's a lot too, I didn't include that. But this year I wait, it's your drive yeah, to pick and some, uh, but, but finally, because too many. Uh, um, will um, uh, too many um, many animal uh, many uh, squirrel, squirrel and some animal eat a lot so I have to pick all of them because uh, the carry mango I already pick it they have nothing and the neighbor carries mango or he already pick all of them so they not uh, and they target with the the lame mango. So I have to pick all them because they eat about uh, five, ten of them each, uh, at night each day. So now they can do my uh, another mango. It's a Valencia mango, and they choose the big one, the biggest, and the best one. I'm gonna. <laughs> So I will record as video for you to see. But so far right now, I have here. Most of them I cut. I uh, I cut when it's ripe. Uh, place on the um, the freezer, freezer, and some I uh, I dry. And some I uh, make the gems. So far, I still have uh, some two packets here, kind of two packets of lens mango here, and some in uh, my refrigerator. So probably three packets of um, a lens mango left. Okay, I will dry them all right Hi, right, thank you for watching. That's uh, my update for lens mango mainly. 
but for the Valencia mango, now they target my Valencia mango. I still have the Tommy Atkins mango by over there. Uh, there, but um, they don't want the Tommy Atkins. They choose the best mango to eat first, and they leave it on the rest side. So that's why I know that's the Tommy Atkins. Then uh, I try, but now they target on the Valencia price mango. I'm um, good. Uh,